it's Chesterfield's big night at Anfield but Liverpool come into this game with several changes and unfamiliar names in Charnock wearing eight Hutchinson nine and Cosma the Hungarian one of the two substitutes Chesterfield just one change to their side there's no McGugan tonight Lee Rogers wears six and takes his place referee is Pip Wright. he comes from just down the road at Northwich and Liverpool get us started in the second round first leg tie in the Coca-Cola Cup Williams again Rogers looking for Morris and Morris has made it a chance and there's Norris he scored for Chesterfield six minutes gone and Liverpool have been beaten by Chesterfield's first strike on goal a typical Chesterfield move in which Rogers picks out Andy Morris the big man he outleaped the England defender and at close quarters there was Steve Norris to poke it home Chesterfield leading here at Anfield Liverpool nil Chesterfield won six minutes gone so Chesterfield happy to push forward and not sit on that one goal advantage that they have goal coming up to six minutes now they'll have to defend because Hebbard's been outstripped here by Walters Cash comes across there but Walters is passed into the goal line and Rosenthal and Mulby and really with Hutchinson at the far post on his left foot Liverpool making a complete hash of that negatively on the right Marsh now it's Rosenthal trying to get past Brian does well Rosenthal a chance for him to shoot and he does shoot and a good save that from McLennard Mulby he spotted Rosenthal ahead of him and Rosenthal first time isn't far wide and Liverpool start to get closer to the target that's the best effort by far that time Rosenthal unlocking the defence down the right hand side for Liverpool latching onto the long ball from Mulby and he wasn't that far wide right James is in trouble here and Lancaster has scored for Chesterfield an horrendous mistake by Liverpool right putting his goalkeeper under all sorts of pressure with an appalling back pass James couldn't control it in stole Lancaster Morris creating the problem but Wright just had no idea where his goalkeeper was he couldn't pick it up from there and Lancaster happy to accept the opportunity to make it Liverpool nil Chesterfield 2 Morris wants this one but Wright is the winner of the header initially but it matters little for Chesterfield because they've won it back and here is Morris Carr on the outside his cross there Norris is there and it's on target from Lancaster great header that from Lancaster and so nearly Chesterfield's third of the night Morris was well marshalled there by Mark Wright. He knows he's been in a game today, the England centre-back. And Andy Morris is the man that's given him that game. That'll do us. That's half-time. And when this one's flashed around the scoreboards of the country at half-time, they won't quite believe it. Believe it, it's true. Norris and Lancaster, the scorers, as the scoreline at half-time reads, Liverpool nil, Chesterfield 2. Lancaster, Norris... Andrews going in there, Morris. To Redknapp. Cash inside. Mark Wright. And a chance for Lancaster. And Lancaster has scored for Chesterfield. Three minutes into the second half. And Mark Wright has made another blunder in the Liverpool defence to set up Dave Lancaster. What an amazing scoreline as Lancaster latches on to the error from Mark Wright to score his second of the night. Chesterfield's third. It's Liverpool nil. It's Chesterfield three. There it is. 
right. Kosma. That's a good ball to Walters. Kosma has got it in there to Rosenthal, who scored. That's a brilliant goal for Liverpool. And Norris turns to the crowd and urges them to cheer more and louder. And the police are now trying to get the Chesterfield fans to sit down. And they're living in a dream world. Both the police and the Chesterfield fans as the corner comes and Mo Lancaster and David James collided there and James went down under that challenge and so I think he's won himself a free kick. Cash. Probably the best Chesterfield player on the park. And that's of quite a few. Lemon. Just a bit too far ahead of Lancaster but Williams now with a chance and that wasn't far over for number four Lancaster pushed off it easily by Redknapp and now Rosenthal is he offside no he's hit the post he's onside and hit the post Lemon takes it oh and a header there oh and he couldn't be followed in by Morris Norris his little header a fumble save from David James and again, Chesterfield come within a whisker of four. Oh, but that was not a good ball to Hebbard. And here's Mark Walters on target. Good save. But it's rolled back to Hutchinson, who scored. Liverpool second. Walters. Walters. Tees it up for Tanner. And Tanner's ball is not good. But Marsh has a chance now. And a great save there from Leonard. Now Walters. In a great position here, Walters. Another good save from Leonard. That seems to be a handball against Rosenthal. Hebert though for Chesterfield. Car first time. And Liverpool looking for offside. It's not given. It's Norris. He's in the clear. 4 2. His second of the night for Chesterfield. Their fourth. He can celebrate. Chesterfield can as well. Almost a goal from nothing. Car's long ball through. Right. A moment's hesitation, it looked to the linesman. But Norris was onside when the ball was played. We won't see the incident where it was played through. We will see the moment that he beats David James with a fierce left footy drive. And Chesterfield extend their lead. Liverpool 2, Chesterfield 4. Hutchinson. Rosenthal back to Hutchinson. And here's Walters. Walters the chance. And Walters has accepted the chance and scored Liverpool's third. Brian headed away. Hebbard. Morris. And Hebbard here in the clear. Hebbard has got an opportunity to open things up for Chesterfield. He's still going, Hebbard. Oh, he couldn't get his foot around the ball. He knew what he was trying to do. Great play from Trevor Hebbard. Koshmar. Got Carr in his way. Left footed cross there. And right steals in. And he scored to make amends for earlier blunders. To level the score for Liverpool at four apiece. James to Burrows. Comes through to Rosenthal. Chance for him, and inside him is Redknapp, Redknapp is letting go through to Hutchinson, and Hutchinson can score! And somehow off Tony Bryan, off the post, and away the second time Liverpool have hit the woodwork in this half. Well, that sprung from nothing there, Rosenthal so clever, and Redknapp too as the cross comes in. And just as well it did, because that's the end of the game. And Chesterfield have performed heroics by being the first team since the 1960s to score four at Anfield, two to Norris, two to Lancaster. Their supporters applaud and appreciate them. They do the like. Liverpool scoring four times two through Wright, Rosenthal, Hutchinson and Walters. The second leg to come in a couple of weeks' time. That should be something to look forward to. But here at Anfield, Liverpool four... Chesterfield for the two goal scorers in front of you.